if you are by saying the Russians will destroy these road warriors. Now I want to talk about my nephew, Nikita. All you got to do is go to NWA record book, win-loss record book, and you can see Nikita is number one contender. Oh yes, there's a lot of other top contenders, like Nature Boy, Buddy Landell, this American Dream, Dusty Rhodes, Magnum TA. I could go on and on. But the, the fact is that Nikita is number one challenger for Ric Flair. Now we invite you. We invite you, David Crockett, right. along with Press and Rick Flair to come to press conference in Dungeon. You see how awesome Nikita was, how determined Nikita is in his training camp. Right. But Rick up. Flair, he never show up. He never come there. He ignore us. So what do we do? We go out and we track this Rick Flair down. We go to arena to watch Rick Flair in defense of his world title. We set an audience. We have Americans ridicule us throw bad insults at us, throw garbage at us, wait, but we don't do anything in America. Where, where, where you are right now? You're in America, right? This is you're right, not, we're in America. Not, but right. again, Nikita, he challenged Ric Flair after the match, and it's Ric Flair. Hey, wait a minute. He and turned around he and he just ignored us. He just wrestled, didn't he? Surely he, he wrestled. Right, why should he wrestle him then? Of course he'd have an advantage. But wait, at wait, least wait he could do is acknowledge you, that we are there and that he would sign contract. Shut up a minute. You talk about Ric Flair and what he is and what he is. Let me tell you something about Ric Flair. He is the world heavyweight champion, and he's going to stay the world heavyweight champion. You know why? Because I've seen Rick like no one else has. He was in an accident a long time ago. Well, a few years ago, and I was in it too. I was lucky, but he wasn't. They said he wouldn't wrestle again. When he was in that hospital, I saw him... He was determined to get back in that ring, and he did. And he became world heavyweight champion, and he's been that way ever since. If he's such a great world champion, why doesn't he sign contract against the Dieter? What do we have to he do to get contract? He has other contracts. He has other matches. Well, let me say this, David Crockett. Well, uh, Ric Flair is such a great listen, man. Here, listen, why he, is he, he is taking great. everybody? What? Why he is, is he... the world heavyweight champion, that's why. Would you quit interrupting me? Why does he keep avoiding us all He's the time? He's not avoiding you. He has contracts to fill. He's the world heavyweight champion. Just because this guy says that he's going to be world heavyweight champion doesn't mean he is the world heavyweight. It doesn't, it doesn't mean that he's the number one challenger. You go out and you say, well, we, we don't deserve to be in this country. Well, we have proven ourselves. We are the key to people from behind? Are you calling me coward? Check out David Crockett. Oh, no. Well, now we're going to look back at the ring. Nikita Kolov is just... He just knocked David Crockett right off his feet. 